Hey, everybody in here, sitting in a tiny house, having my coffee with all of you lovely people. And it's supposed to rain today, so i got to get out and do some things real quick here. And then we're going to talk about these two new chickens that I've got right over here, right next to me. <clears throat> Rocky Two may have got out in a couple of places. This right here had a hole chewed into it, so last night I just pulled this over and kind of rigged it up quickly. <laughs> so, because it was getting dark, and then there was another hole like right there in the chicken wire where the two wires join so I joined those back together and I forgot I had this heavy duty this much left I didn't think that there was that much left of it but um, I haven't secured it permanently yet because um, what I want to do is I want to come back in here and remove all of this stuff so that I can repurpose it for something else it's wearing out especially this part because the sun beats down on it and it's not going to last forever but um, so I've just zip tied it for now so I can easily remove it I didn't want to put the um, fence clips on it yet um, and just put these back here and uh, put a couple bricks out um, but it's secure pretty well and I don't think anybody can chew through this part now so that's good and another good thing is it went all the way over here and I just kind of secured it and wrapped it around so it's getting ready to rain and that's why I did it kind of you know half you know what because it's gonna be raining here probably any minute now and I wanted to make sure that these were these roosters weren't gonna be able to get out um, so yeah eventually I'll be able to take this stuff out and reuse it for something else um, it's not gonna be for to keep chickens in or dogs out or anything it's probably going to be used in the garden in some way so I'm glad I at least got this done today look at these gorgeous roosters oh my gosh I want to find good homes for them but I'm not going to list them on Craigslist because a lot of people they still engage in that uh, rooster fighting there's another word for it but I'm not going to say it and um, I really just don't want people like that coming onto my property. Um, I'd be willing to give them away, but they're just gorgeous. They are absolutely gorgeous, and I think they'd make great roosters for a flock. So, somebody, anybody, please can tell me that you want my roosters. Another thing I want to do before it rains is I found some pine cones, and when I was looking for Rocky yesterday trying to chase him back, and um, I threw them over the ledge, so I'm going to go collect those before they get rained on and gather some more kindling wood. Not too shabby. Yeah, that's a pretty good haul there. So funny. Go to the store or to craft stores. People pay $5, 10 $15 for a bag of these. Um, and much smaller quantity, too. And I've got them all over the place. I also like to collect bark if it's really, really dry. This is from, I think it's an old pine. And it's very dry and it just lights up really really quickly and gets the fire going really well so I like to find it and break it up and bring it inside and start a fire with it Ooh, looky a big fat slug I'm gonna go and see if I can find mama and feed it to her there she is I wonder if I can give it to her without anybody else getting it let me just be sneaky about it She's not going to come to me. Let me see if I can toss it to her. Come on, get it, girl. Where did it go? Oh. Patsy got it. Who's doing all that squawking? Who is that? Is that Miss Pris? Looks like Miss Pris. Hope you, hopefully you guys are all laying eggs. We got an Easter egg in there. I did find some pieces of wood that are going to be suitable. In fact, they're almost perfect, just a little bit long. I could cut some of it off. That's not a big deal. These two are absolutely perfect. So what's going to happen is they're just going to go 
up underneath it here and I'm gonna screw them in like that it'll still be able to drain and then this one will go over here I'll leave the existing you know um, screen in there and then those are just gonna go up underneath of here so I think that that'll work a little bit better long term look at that blue sky it was supposed to start raining an hour ago I don't know if it's gonna rain at all now <laughs> Which is cool because it's sunny and it's warm. Hooray! I got a green one in here. That's pretty nice looking, isn't it? Okay, let's talk about these new chickens that I got. Um, the lady who was selling them, and I had the feeling that she was selling them for somebody else. Um, she said that they were either blue or black copper morans, or they were mixed blue and black copper morans. I don't know. I didn't care. Um, and she did say that she didn't know if they were, you know, pullets or cockerels, you know, hens or roosters. Um, and they've grown a little bit and they've made some changes over the last few days. So we're going to take a look at these and, uh, yeah, we're going to, we're going to decide. I got one in my hands. Whoops. Okay. First one. There is no way on God's green earth. That this little chicken is a hen. Yeah, so this is a rooster, and his comb is just getting darker and darker, and he's got bigger wattles. Um, and I've been looking into the breed quite a bit and doing some research, and this one definitely looks like a rooster. Hi, hi, I think I'm going to call you Fred. Look at Say hello, Fred. He doesn't have any saddle feathers yet, but it's too soon for that. But he is starting to show some speckles of red on his feathers and his back a little bit. Um, I couldn't show them to you because he was getting upset with me. But uh, yeah, I, I'm. It, it, that's one. That one has got to be a rooster. So let's pick up the other one and see what you think about that. Here's the other one slightly smaller comb comb is lighter in color smaller wattles but i still think that this is a rooster um a little bit of uh, red starting to come up golden on the chest that's not abnormal for black copper morans and i still don't know you know if it's a black or a blue um but this one is slightly smaller there is a chance that this one might still be a hen but I don't think so I just think that this is a smaller rooster so I don't care you know and she didn't say that they were hens or roosters look it look it you're so cute um, and they were only five dollars a piece so um, I think I got two roosters here that's okay I already know somebody who wants one yeah I already she already kind of let me know um, and the other one, I would definitely like to have a blue or black copper Moran's rooster because then I can put the Easter eggers in there, um, and maybe get some olive eggers, who knows. But, um, yeah, let's see if I could show you there. Look at those furry feet, oh my gosh. So I don't know, they could be mixed with something else. Um, they could be a blue copper morans or a black copper morans all i know is i don't think i got hens here you guys i think i got two roosters so i'm gonna keep raising them and once i know for sure um well then we'll we'll decide what to do look it so sweet oh don't poop on me um tail feathers whoops sorry um, this one doesn't have as much of the curly effect as the other one does, so I don't know. Maybe this one might be a hen, but I don't know. I don't think so. Oops, hold on, hold on. So I may have two roosters. I may have one rooster and a hen. It doesn't matter. That's just fine because if they're both roosters, I'm going to keep one and hopefully give away the other roosters that I have, the three roosters in that pen, put the black copper morans, and I think it's... a I'm leaning more towards black copper morans. I don't know. Um, put him in there, we in their pen, 
uh, and put the Easter eggers in there so maybe they can get together and maybe I can get some olive eggers going. I don't know. Um, and if it's one rooster and one hen, I can put both of them in the pen, put the Easter eggers in there, and who knows, maybe I'll be able to get some more. But if they're both roosters, that's okay. Lena, Lena, if they're both roosters, you're definitely going to get one of these roosters because you voiced an interest in them. So anyhow, it's finally started raining. Um, thank goodness, uh, because I got all my stuff done. I went and fixed the water catchment system so it would capture properly. I cleaned out the wash basin outside, plugged it up so it'll fill with water. Maybe I can do some laundry. I did do some more dishes today. Um, and so I think the rest of the day it's going to be just an indoor day. I may work on some insulation. I don't know. I do know that I bought these little um, Hawaiian bread um, dinner rolls, and I want to make some black bean veggie burger sliders. Oh, that would be delicious. So, yeah, I think that's all I got for you guys today. See you in the next video. Thanks for watching everybody. I hope you enjoyed the video. Make sure you like, subscribe, hit the bell, and y'all have a good one.